Hello, Yibi and Pop Life South Africa. This is me, Samuel Harold Hendricks, your loyal customer since before lockdown. I just wanted to say thanks a lot, guys. This really, it's always a pleasure, you know, ordering from you guys high quality Funko Pops. And yeah, I think let's just let's just get into this amazing box that you guys sent me and or that I ordered from you. And let's let's just dive, dive straight in. Ooh, this looks nice. Let's see. Mmm, you guys know me too well. And I love the fact that you guys have, sometimes at the right time, you have sweets available on your website. I just happened to order the Hershey's Cookies and Cream Imported Candy Bar. Very nice. Full points on that one. But that's not all. So, uh, I don't know if I can show this, but let's have a look see. You see, where else in South Africa do you get Funko Pops? from South Africa's leading Funko retailer that is packaged with so much bubble wrap not to cause any dent or damage to your Funko Pops whatsoever. Okay, so we're literally into the multiverse of madness at this point. Ah, the newest Avenger from the Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness movie, America Chavez, in her traditional ancient monastery robes learning the art of the mystic, learning the mystic arts from Doctor Strange and Wong, Sub Sorcerer Supreme. So that's America Chavez. And as we continue digging through this treasure trove of a box that I ordered from Pop Life, let's have a look see. Oh, oh I've waited so long for this one actually. Now, you got this, this is, as they say, a spoiler alert. So, this is Captain Carter, not Captain America, Captain Carter, from a scene somewhere in Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness, where Doctor Strange is brought before the Illuminati, and Captain Carter just so happens to be one of the Illuminati members. And I must say, I love the detail of the, of the suit, especially the, the shield with the Union Jack on it, which besides for my own country's flag, which is South Africa, is the most beautiful country's uh, most beautiful country flag in the world. Now I'm almost almost through my entire box, and ah, oh, this is one I have been waiting for for a long, a long time. This is one I've actually been hunting since I started collecting Funko Pops, and it's Cowboy Joey from. Friends, and this is this is literally like one of my favorite Joey moments captured in one Funko Pop. Uh, I can't remember. I think it was season one or season two. I'm not completely sure, but Joey has a standoff at a at a cologne company with a guy called or simply known as the Cowboy, and then he decides, okay, but if he's gonna win the girl, which he does in the end, spoiler alert, he's gonna dress up as a cowboy. So that's Joey. The cowboy. And then of course, ooh, wait a minute, what's this? What's this? this, 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 this? Oh. You see, this is what I love about Pop Life. They reward they reward their loyal customers. And sometimes if you're a regular of theirs like myself, they send you a teeny tiny little thank you gift to say thank you for doing such great business with them. And <laughs> oh my word guys. When I see this pen which is A Nightmare on Elm Street, Freddy Krueger. I can't help but think of that song that the victims usually used to sing to Freddy. Oh, well, if Freddy's coming for you, I think it was like, uh, Freddy Krueger's coming for you. Something, something like that. But this is very cool. And what Pop Life also did as another first for me, this is my first horror Funko Pop pen. Well, it's a pen in this case, but it's my first Funko Pop horror item. And I will definitely, definitely be looking very well after this. So thank you, Pop Life. Thank you for your great business. Cheers.